to bring out some pretty special people to join me on the field. These events just don't happen without amazing planning committees. And this event is no different from our other events. So I'd like you to give it up as I bring them out here to a round of applause for all their hard work. First of all, the chair, Mr. Peter Tuerstra. Come on in. Peter spends a lot of time organizing this event. Also, Steven Schwarzenfruber. Come on out, please. Shiva Damas. And Kaylee Bibbick. So these are the people that make it happen, so thank you very much for all you With so many fantastic volunteers helping to make an event like this possible, it is really difficult to single out a particular person. Without our over 2,000 volunteers across Canada, events like this simply would not happen. I want to give a big thank you to all those that volunteer with their teams, at promotional first events, and our competitions. Thank you so much. Today we're going to honor and recognize one of our outstanding volunteers. This individual is no stranger to FRC events, both as a competitor and as a volunteer. I believe he has been to almost all of our FRC events in Canada over the last three years, including Montreal and Calgary. When we needed him, he was always there to help. He assumed major roles at these events, from scorekeeping, field power, to control system advisor, to our field bosses, the FTA. All the while, this volunteer maintains his composure and ensures that you, the teams, get the best experience possible at our events. I have even recently seen him expanding his horizons and trying his hand in emceeing matches. Please give it up for our 2015 Volunteer of the Year at the Waterloo Regional, Mr. Parth Patel. This team has spirit. 
teamwork, and perseverance. They have exceptional ambitions for engaging and educating their community about science and technology, partnering with a new STEM-focused school, and providing new ways to excite students. They love demonstrating and teaching all things STEM, from underwater robots to cameras in space to publishing children's books. This team spirit is ironclad. Congratulations to Team 4083, Iron Wolverines.
It celebrates creativity, creativity, design, use of components, and for unique strategy of play. Here's what the Genesis has to say. This team's creativity began in the design process with a unique field simulation. From these efforts, they covered the full spectrum of the design. With interchangeable parts and minimal, minimalist construction, this robot works as a cohesive family set. This team proves that every shift counts. Congratulations to the global family of makeshift robotics team. <laughs>
Lawrence, Logan, Gordon, down there. B15, Corbin, and the Beats. Okay, let's get to this year's award for Before I do that, uh, I have to give a shout out to the Manners students. You need to recognize your Manners. Without them, you would not be here. We would not have teams and we would not have an event. So give it up for your Manners right now. Okay, the Woody Flowers Award celebrates effective communication in the art and science of engineering and design. Dr. William Murphy founded this award in 1996 to recognize mentors who are strong leaders and who inspire and empower using excellent communication skills to help their student and team members understand the challenges, opportunities, and satisfaction involved in the discipline of engineering and design. For 2015, FIRST recognizes one mentor at each regional and one mentor from each district championship with the Whitney Flowers Finalist Award. At the first championship in April, one mentor will be selected from this year's finalists and renominated prior year finalists and will be presented with the 2015 Championship Whitney Flowers Award. New this year, each Whitney Flowers finalist will receive a blue banner <laughs> and, uh, for their team to display proudly. The judging panel believes the Blue Banner will emphasize the importance of the partnership between students, mentors, and everyone who is part of a first team. For the Waterloo Regional, this is what the student nominating essay had to say about this person. This mentor challenges his students with real world problems. He teaches them design process and employs programs such as Trello, Rabcat, Tortoise, Tortoise, and Assembly. He introduced a course in FIRST showing his students the basic math behind such things as gearboxes and arms. He is also a big part of this team's postseason review, encouraging students to follow through with their ideas to help improve their team. This FRC team is very appreciative of the time they share with this special mentor. And we would like to help them thank him by awarding the Woody Flowers Finalist Waterloo Regional Award to Mr. Stephen Lau for his <laughs> We've got 15 more matches tomorrow, and an incredible day. That's kind of just 
we're gonna rock this one. It's gonna come straight up. So I'll see you tomorrow. There's a social tonight around 7:30. 7 to 8:30. That's when pits closes at 7. Hope to see you tomorrow, folks.